Welcome to this BI Quick Tip. For more background on the BI tool, please visit our Help Files website. In this video, we'll show you how to utilize hierarchy filters for your story. This will help you to find data that you're looking for much quicker and easily. Let's begin. Starting from our story, we'll click on the story filter or prompt icon here. Then we'll click on add story filter or prompt icon and select commitment item. From here, we'll click on the drop down arrow and we can see the default hierarchy is always flat presentation. We can change our current hierarchy to any of the available drop down options. For this case scenario, we'll use revenue and expense. We'll select all members and then click on OK. Next, we can see our filter here and clicking on this will expand our filter. Let's say we only want to see our expenses. We'll uncheck all and then click on our expense. The story will automatically recognize our filter and load the data we need. We could do the same thing if we need to view our revenues as well. Expanding this symbol here will show you a list of all commitment items available in our revenue. If we wanted to use another hierarchy and filter, we could just remove this one by clicking on the X button here. Then, we'll repeat the same process, but we'll use the labor and fringe hierarchy instead to show another example. Let's say we only wanted to see academic salaries. We'll make sure that's the only box selected and our story will filter and load the data. Besides commitment item, you can enable hierarchy search for fun org unit and fund center dimension. Feel free to utilize this method when trying to find the data you need easily. Thank you for watching this episode of the BI Quick Tips series. You can find all BI Quick Tip videos on the Help Files website. Until next time.